Hi everyone, it's Zishan here, and today I'll be teaching you how to make these really cute mini candy canes. And um, just so you know, I am trying to up. Um, I'm going to be um filming a lot of videos today because I am going to be busy for the past two weeks. Pat next two or three weeks so i have to get all my videos up um by i have to make all my videos and upload them the days so i can sound a bit tired and sound a bit weird sometimes so um yeah um if you want to learn how to make these really cute mini candy canes then stay tuned and now let's get started on the things you'll need so to make these really cute candy canes, you'll need a loom, a hook, and today I'm going to be using my rainbow loom hook, and you will also need some rubber bands. You can choose any color you want your candy canes to be. You can make them rainbow, you can make them like mine, you can make them pink with um white red with white any color but today i'm going to be making this one so i'm going to be using pink with white so yeah once you've got all these things ready then let's get on with how to make this candy cane so the first thing you'll do is let me just zoom in a little bit more okay there so the first thing you'll do is you're going to grab one rubber band and first you're going to use white and you're going to put that in this side of your loom and you can use any loom for this design. And then you're going to grab two rubber bands. Now two um, white rubber bands are just going to go on like this and by the way this is quite an easy design if you know how to make how, how to make the single chain bracelet so yeah and if you know how to tie a slip knot so yeah now we're going to use the pink let me just zoom out just like a little bit there now we're going to use the pink and you're going to grab two pink or two whatever color you're using so yep and you're just going to put that on like this and we're going to do seven loops so we're gonna have this so right now we have two so far let's put on the third right here on two three we have three loops here's four by the way, you can use any color. I think I said that before, but um, candy canes are normally, I see them in red and white, but I just like the color of pink and white together. So yeah, two more, and you're gonna go up. White bands now. So let's see how we how much we have. You've got one, two, three, four, five. We just need two more. So let's get two these colors and let's put that there oops and two more last rubber bands and we're gonna put that there and now we've got seven let's count one two three four five six seven now we're going to grab one of pink rubber one um pink rubber band or red whatever color and going to tie this off with the slip uh, with um a cat band so you can either do it here or you can do it on your hook i'm gonna do it on my hook because i normally do slip knots here i mean cat bands so you're going to put this on your hook you're gonna twist this into a figure eight and you're gonna put that on and you're going to do the same thing again. So let's just zoom in to show you if you've never done a cat band before. So we're going to do this 
grab one of this one. You're going to twist it like that and get it in. So now you can see the three little loops. We're going to do that once again to get four. There. So now we can put this on our loom. So you're going to put this on this last peg right here. And it's okay if you don't get it in the first time. I mean, you don't have to, but literally, you need to get it, though. Okay. Or, and so you can do it that way, or I want to show you the um, loom way. So you can also do it like this, and you're going to put it on your loom, and you can do that. Twist it, oops. Twist it and put it on Twist it, put it on, and then twist it and put it on. So yeah, you just need it four times, and then you're going to turn your loom around. And you're going to grab your hook, and you're going to start looming. So you're going to go inside these right here. going to grab this rubber band right over here, and you're going to pull this up right here and make sure you don't pull it too tight because look i have this strand right here it's going to put my hook in i don't want to break the rubber band so i'm just going to put my hook in and just tighten it like that everything's gonna be all right okay there so you're just going to try to tighten it like this oh there you go got it so there you go. Now you're going to go in this and you're going to grab this, these two, hook them up, grab these two now, and hook them up. And you're just going to keep on going up to here. Don't hook the single band yet. So um, I'm not going to edit. I'm not going to um, go off camera for this part just because uh, this is like super short. So yeah. So now you can, so you stop here and now this single rubber band, you're going to go in, you're going to grab the same normally, loop it up, but you're going to grab the bottom rubber band right here and, and you're not going to go inside, you're going to go on the outside and grab the rubber band, pull it up and over. Now you can grab this rubber band and give it a little tug. And then you can leave it on this band or you can just leave it like that. But I'm just for safetyness, I'm going to leave it on this just in case of the slipknot untightens. And you can take <clears throat> the thing off the loom. But it's not going to look like a candy cane right now because look at the comparison. Duh. So now here comes the waving part. Um, it's really simple. You're just going to grab your hook. Um, it's not that simple. Now that I think about it, you're going to go in the camera. You need to focus. Focus there. You're going to go in here. So you're going to find one, two, the, the second one. And you're going to go in it. And then now you're going to grab this rubber band. And you're just going to push it on here. And you're just going to pull this through that. Like that. Now I'm just going to leave that, and now what you're going to do is you're going to find the pink on the bottom of that, which is this one, and you're going to go in, and you're now you're going to grab this rubber band again that you just waved, and then you're going to put that there, and you're going to pull it, and this makes it um shape well this is the one that actually makes it shape like a candy cane but not exactly you have to first just get another rubber band put that on and you're just going to wave this through that and oopsies there we go like that oops this is seriously gonna take me forever okay there now you can just shape um, however you would like your candy cane to be. So I'm going to just, I like to shape it like this and then pull 
um, yeah. There. My candy cane is done. So, um, yeah. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a like. And also, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And, yeah. I'll see you all in my next video. Bye! Alright guys, I forgot to tell you that I am also going to be uploading a video with how to make these candy canes without a loom, with only your hook. So stay tuned for that guys, I forgot to mention it in the video, so um, yeah, I'll see you all next time, bye!